Have you ever felt the slim hand of fear crawling up your spine? Or shiver from the cold breath of the reaper? Perhaps you have heard the whistle of insanity as you fulfill your own selfish desires? <laughs> Thank you, Vincent, for that introduction. <laughs> and here we are on our final drawing or final editing phases for Coraline. And overall, I found it pretty good, pretty good. It's my first time trying to do an art style that is more focused on creepy and less cute. If you've been following me for a while, you may have noticed that I tend to create monsters that are more on the cute side. That was very much inspired by Brandon uh, Santiago's Irma, which is available on Webtoons if you haven't seen that. But back to Coraline, which is probably why you clicked on this video. I find that as I continue to learn more about Neil Gaiman or Gaiman and his price, uh, process about writing and how he came up with the idea for Coraline, the more intrigued I am in, at attempting to do something, you know, of my own tier as far as creepy but something that's also a little bit cute at least in style and things like that one of the things i really appreciate about the film is that it doesn't decide to go too far it it is just the right amount of creepy so that if you're a younger audience you are creeped out the entire time but on the other hand if you're an older audience member you still get those little shivers of down your spine and you get upset about it and there's nothing wrong with feeling upset about it because it's that's the intention and it does such a great job with the music the art style and obviously the story and it's such a good adaptation just because it focuses in on what makes you feel unsettled because it seems a little too nice anyhow Thank you for joining me for Mad Media, and I hope you have a good rest of your day. And please, if you like this sort of video, like, share, and subscribe. And remember to be good and do good towards one another. And I hope you have a good rest of your day, and oh, happy October. Catch you next time.